have at last? No. She's your responsibility. She has. We look after her. We see you all, all your love. I will see your life. I will. I will. Please. Thank I will. you. Good afternoon, everybody. In life, there is no greater gift than to love and to be loved in return. When you marry, you promise to love and cherish for the rest of your life. That is a long time, and although time flies by, the road travelled is not always smooth. Friends are there to celebrate the delights with you and to support you when things don't quite go as planned. I would now like to welcome you all to witness the wedding of Jack and Yu Ting as, as husband and wife. What we do today is done in conformity to the laws of this country and in the historical tradition of the act of marriage. Jack and Yu Ting, you have requested that I marry you. Do you both do this of your own desire and free will? We do. Does anyone here know of any reason why we may not continue with this wedding? <laughs> Whew, that's a relief. Do you, Jack, take Yu Ting to be your wedded wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love, honour and cherish till death do you part? I do. And do you, Yu Ting, take Jack to be your wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love, honour and cherish till death you do part? Yes, I do. Then it is my pleasure to pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss the bride. If you'd all like to uh, follow us back down the aisle and uh, continue the celebration back out in the communal area. Thank you very much. thinking about what to say in this speech, um, which was actually something that I haven't done at any of the other weddings so far. I've managed to avoid that. Um, I sort of thought back to when Ting and I first met, and I thought of all these romantic occasions and happy memories that we have together, but then I thought back to the actual first time we met. In 2011, when I uh, flew to Japan, 
It was a sweltering 35 degrees. I had no idea what was going on. I couldn't read or speak Japanese. Um, I was shoveled into this dormitory and, and went to bed under what apparently was actually a mattress, which didn't help the heat. Um, I woke up, had a couple of drinks with some people upstairs and staggered back to bed. The next morning, feeling pretty awful, very confused and very hungry. Um, <laughs> I came upstairs and went into the, uh, the, 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 yeah, the communal area. Thanks, mum. <laughs> and sat there wearing this yellow dress with, uh, with a lady whose name I would learn to be Ting. And I thought, yeah, she's all right. <laughs> <laughs> but we were only in Japan for a year. And obviously Ting was from Taiwan and I'm from the UK. And that's when I learned that she'd already applied to a, a list of universities. She was going to study in the UK the next year which was just one of many coincidences that had led to us meeting in the first place. Ting told me that the list of universities that she'd applied to and been accepted at, which was an impressive range, um, and, what, and wanted my opinions. And it was happenstance that one of them was Leeds. And she was like, Jack, what's a better university, Leeds or St. Andrews? Needless to say, she went to Leeds. <laughs> and uh, we haven't really looked back, looked back since. The next thing I'd like to say is thank you to all of Ting's family. Um, I thought I'd visited Taiwan six or seven times, but according to William, it's four. So he's keeping better track than I am. Um, and each time I've been, they've made me only feel more and more welcome, which I never thought was possible. Um, more and more full and definitely fatter. <laughs> but they've been incredibly welcoming. I owe them all so much and I just hope that I can make your time in the UK even slightly as enjoyable as the time I've spent in Taiwan. Um, I owe you a huge debt and um, we've got the rest of our lives to pay it back to you. So I hope that I, hope that I can manage to do that. With that, I'd just like to raise a toast to my beautiful wife and uh, say cheers. Thank you very much. Cheers. Cheers.